Hey, Psych2Goers, has someone caught your interest? Do you feel butterflies in your stomach around them? Unless you have a strange addiction to eating live winged insects, it's likely you have a crush. But how can you tell if they feel the same way about you? Are they at least interested in you? Well, here are some common signs that someone likes you. Here are six signs someone is interested in you. Number one, they're awkward only around you. Do you get nervous around your crush? A lot of people can become a bit awkward at first when someone they like talks to them. If you notice your crush's behavior strangely shifts when they notice you, this could be a sign that you make them nervous. This is likely because they're attracted to you. So if you notice they start to fumble over their words or get lost staring into your eyes, they're probably very nervous being around someone they find so attractive. Number two, their voice changes pitch and their tone is different around you. You've been noticing your crush talks to you differently than other people or maybe their tone is suddenly lower or higher when talking to you. For women, their voice will often become more high pitched, while men will often deepen their voice when attracted to someone. Their tone may also change as well. Suddenly they're much kinder, or perhaps their voice sounds a bit sexier. Maybe they sound very gentle or mysterious. Either way, unless they sound rude, they may subconsciously be doing this because they like you. Number three, they're engaged in your conversations. Having a deep conversation with them? Look closely. Do they look engaged in your conversation? Or are they on their phone? Are they scanning around the room? Are they looking at something else? If they don't engage with you often on an emotional level, or even any level during your outings, then it's likely they don't like you on an emotional level. However, if they ask follow-up questions and keep their focus with you, then it's another good sign they are interested in you. Number four, they text you often and comment on your social media. Do you and your crush have each other's number? Do they text you often? Or maybe they message you on social media? Comment on your posts? If they wanna be more than friends with you, they'll likely want to keep up the conversation with you, not just with in-person chats, but online as well. If they are into social media and are often on their phone, they'll likely show their interest through texts, funny memes, or gifs, and a few flirty texts as well. They could be shy, so they may be trying to hint at hanging out with you first, or maybe they just go right into the subtle flirting with the heart eye emoji. Number five, they keep the conversation going and ask questions. Do they try to keep the conversation going by asking questions and mentioning interesting points of their own? It can sometimes be difficult to do this, but if they've been trying to continue chats with you, this is a good sign they like you. This can be through text too, this could mean they bring up random things about their day, interesting comments on a show they're watching, or even send those funny memes. They'll try to make an excuse to talk to you. And once you start talking, they'll generally put a bit of effort into keeping the conversation going. But often for a conversation to continue, you'll wanna put in effort too. If you don't, they may be wondering if you like them as much as they like you. So let them know you enjoy talking to them. Then your conversations may become effortless. And number six, they're always hinting that their schedule is free or they ask you out. Do they find ways to mention their schedule and how free they are this Tuesday or a Friday afternoon? Maybe they randomly mention they have an extra ticket to a concert and ask if you like the band, but it flies past you and you say you've never really heard their music. Oh, <sighs> my friend. They may be trying to hint that they wanna hang out with you. I don't know why you can't both just ask each other out, but every scenario is different. If they hint that they wanna go somewhere and are free on a certain day, now's your chance to ask them. If they're not putting the effort to even ask you out, or at least hint at their availability, they may not be into you. If you have hung out before, but they've grown distant in asking you out, they may not be as interested as before. The trick is, if you wanna hang out with them, go ahead and ask them. They may be trying to hint that they're available and are waiting for you to make the first move. You never know. They could just feel the same way about you that you feel about them. So somebody please make a move before those butterflies in your stomach start to make you sick. So have you noticed any of these signs? When's the last time you got butterflies in your stomach from being around someone? Feel free to let us know in the comment section down below. We hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to click the like button and share it with a friend or your crush. Subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell icon for more content like this. As always, thanks for watching.